Hey guys and welcome back to what can possibly be the last episode of this season. Season 2, you can see we are just 7 points from Barnsley who are in 2nd. So that means if we can get the points we need, if we can win every game and somehow with the stroke of luck, Barnsley lose all their matches, we can finish in an automatic promotion spot which would be amazing. Nonetheless, we only need 1 point to stick in the to definitely be in the playoffs out of the lot next three games so you can see not much going on in our first game against Peterborough one chance for Shields and that's the way it ended at half time at 0-0 but now the ball's played through for Barnett for Peterborough Lewington narrows the angle and the shot goes wide from the Peterborough player Little now picks up the ball and that's a shot which is comfortably safe by Lewington Shields picks the ball up two cams playing at the moment a lovely ball into Gould can he finish it? he can two cams linking together Shields and Gould and Gould with a wonderful finish on what may say is weak foot but he's more of a two footed player with five star weak foot so it's as if he doesn't even have a weak foot and that was great control close to his body and then the finish on his right foot to put it home and if we can pick up this result that means we will definitely be in the playoffs Zavon Hines though a terrible ball out wide to Josh Scott but he keeps the pressure wins the ball back and slots it home making it 2-0 and yes that does mean we have made the playoffs but where will we finish at the end of the season we still have two games to play we are definitely in the playoffs we'll be third fourth fifth sixth or even second place for us it is 2-0 at full time and we are through to the playoffs definitely into the next game though it is away to Yolville this is another important game news is that Barnsley actually lost their match so you can see they're still on 92 points we're on 88 we're making we're getting even closer to them now now we do have to win this game to keep that pressure on and hope that Barnsley lose or draw their match Midson picks a ball up hits the shot it looked like it hit an arm from Seaborn it did and it is a penalty given to us from the handball from Seaborn Midson's goal was sure to go in so really that should have been a red card but nothing was given Josh Scott steps up can he put it in no he can't Marek Steck with a brilliant save for to keep Yolville in the game and unfortunately to deny us the chance to take the lead Luke Hal though wonderful pressure getting forward now he's got away from his man left foot Steck there to make another good save and you can see we didn't actually have good passing only 64% passing accuracy half time was nil nil so we're going to have to make a difference and it is currently 2 all in the game between Barnsley and Chesterfield so that is a good result if we can manage to pick up 3 points and hopefully Chesterfield can do some, something for us to give us that bit of luck Grant picks a ball up it's played through Dennis with a good header a go-go messing around with it and it comes out to Hawkins he hits it short Sam Walker watches it go wide of the post now quarter of an hour left we're running out of time we have to do something a great ball from Midson Shield tackles Seaborn there the man who gave up the penalty he's got support he crosses it to the far post and winning it is Jack Midson it's nodded in from Davis but the goal goes to hand to Jack Midson's 15th in the league he's coming close to 20 altogether absolutely beautiful play Midson look at that header and could that be a, the bit of luck we still have to defend we've got five minutes remaining it is Grant he gets to cross in Wilkinson with a poor clearance but it finds Midson he has a bad touch and it's Hoskins coming through Doe with a good tackle Upson he plays it through for Hawkins Sam Walker with a massive save Grant plays it back in and Wilkinson gets his header clear and at full time it was 1-0 so what was the score at Barnsley it's the question on the Daggers fans it was 2 all. we are only one point now look at that league table two points sorry we're two points from Barnsley so that means we still can get the luck has gone our way can Barnsley lose or draw if we win by two goals and Barnsley draw we are through to this championship without having to go through the agony of being in the playoffs the but line. currently so it is Barnsley who are going through we need them to here, lose we need to win it's swung in the canavan it's headed well. out by Kay as far as Zavon Hines he hits his shot it looked to hit an arm there was it the ref's gone he's pointed to the spot it is a penalty in the first five minutes of this game and that was the luck we needed Josh Scott he's already missed a penalty he missed a penalty in the last game can he score this one he knocks it pretty much straight down the middle four minutes into the game and we've taken a lead it, we've taken a lead that is a dream start for us 
penalty given. We get that luck. And the then we back off, put it away. And the, ball gets and the luck here. seems to be in our favour. MK Dons are attacking though. Powell, he's in acres of space to put across in. A terrible tackle from Canavan. It's still Powell. He's found Smith, a go-go with a great tackle. But it's back to Smith. Smith, and he plays it through for Bamford. Oh, the best connection, was they? Look and at the that wide. They won uh, the away, shot was dragged wide. Luke Howell plays the ball over for Josh Scott. Can he put this one home? He hits the shot. It's saved by oh, Martin though. Again, we're on the attack. 24 minutes now. Down. Dennis looks for the ball out wide to a go-go. And he finds a great ball through for a brewer go-go. Cuts in, looking for the pass. He does. He finds Shields. He turns his man. But the shot is wide. Now half an hour is played. Only an hour left in the season if we want to try and get automatic promotion. It's come through. It's Zavon Hines. And his shot is saved by Martin. But it's put out for the corner. Zavon Hines, he won it. He's going to swing it in. It's in towards Luke Wilkinson. And we're 2-0 up. And that is exactly what we need. Now, all we want to know is the score at Barnsley. They are playing away to Tranmere. Can Tranmere do us a luck? We're looking for a third though. It is Zavon Hines. He's got that support in Midson. It's a great ball. Midson hits it on the volley. But it flies over the crossbar. And you can see, half time was 2 0. But what is the score at Barnsley? They're playing at Tranmere. Where is it? Tranmere are winning 1 0. This is huge for us. This is exactly what we need. This could be us heading into the playoffs, uh, into the championship with no playoffs, no trip to Wembley, sadly. But we'll, there'll be no pressure on us to win that vital game. Midson and he's put it in and it's 3-0 it is 3-0 this is amazing 52 minutes can we hold on to our lead can Tranmere hold on to their lead if if we lose by one goal as long as Tranmere score uh, Tranmere don't concede then we are sitting in the playoffs Bamford gets the ball here and oh no on the hour mark Bamford he pulls one back for MK Dons we're now sitting at 3-1 Ball's played in. It's Bamford again. Luke Wilkinson with a heroic block, though. On the attack now. Oh no, Scott's been put, brought down. And it looks like he's in a lot of pain down there. And Josh Scott is going to have to be substituted off. Look here. Josh Scott hit a huge blow. He is injured. And you can see Rob and Delaney are now coming on. 80th minute. It's Bulldog. George Bulldog. He was on loan to us last season, if you can remember, as far back as that. But Shield, sorry, plays a great ball through for Jason Roberts. He's in. Can he find the back of the net? His shot flies over the crossbar. Unbelievable. 90th minute. They're attacking. It's through for Baldich. A huge save by Lewington. And Wilkinson heads it clear. Only as far as Williams. It's into Reed. And he can find Bamford. And there it is, the goal. Oh, no. 90th minute and Bamford well, has scored there's still no confirmation of the score the at Tranmere the confirmation of the score is 3-2 to the Daggers and Tranmere uh, Barnsley were able to pull a goal back and they did draw one all and you can see the table there with the same goal difference the same points but they're through on goals four and we are stuck in the league one playoffs so close right to the end 90th minute we lose out but we're facing Peterborough in the playoffs so it's going to be huge leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe to ensure you don't miss a video playoffs will be Saturday if we make the final it will be Sunday and I'll see you guys next time